literally it will burn. So if y'all wonder what I'll be doing all day, most of the day Sunday, or this is what... I'm also certain some of my co-workers want to see me with more gray hairs. Is that... that They've may been be, working hard on that. That may Lol. be it too. Raven but. says I need to bring in a couple of plants. All right, Raven. I was actually thinking about folks up north earlier. That's like, man, it's going to be getting close time for folks to start getting snow. And one of my co-workers said, like, some folks already got snow. I'm like, What? Does anybody in here got snow yet? Jock oh. says I had quite the day yesterday at work. I showed up to find that two of my young techs backed into each other in customers' cars that were both due to be delivered that same day. Plus we had a nail appear in a tell satire. My morning was shot. Dawn Starlight says Ugg you said snow. Lengor says shush. I'm, no. Uh, no, okay. Well, uh, my, lead, my lead mechanic said, dude, there's folks already getting it. And I'm like... Really? And he was like, You're pretty I am in about it. Yeah, man. I think okay. So I just thought about asking. Ruger wife yells, don't jinx us. I'm not. I'm not. I was just asking. I'm so sorry. I'm not trying to jinx anybody. I promise. I swear to all that's holy. I'm not trying to jinx anybody. I would, I would just actually, out of curiosity, 100% just ask, my bad. I am really digging this 40 swing music tonight. Dawn Starlight says it's still 80 degrees here. Quit jumping the gun. I'm, I'm, Jock says if it snows here is Georgia, we will just shut down and drink our bread and eat our milk. There's it. That's it. Same here in Texas. Well, hell, it's going to be 100 degrees next week. It's, I, I'm calling it the uh, summer's little death uh, quivers. You know, those little, what do they call it? Death quirks. The summer death quirks is what I'm going to call it. Raven says it has been too cold for my succulents. Jock says camera lost you. Did it really? Damn, where'd you go, camera? Dude, I'm like, I was sitting right here. It was that damn ghost. Ruger hey. wife says 85 here today. Yeah, that's going to be like 100. Um, Lengor says seconds? lurking to eat dinner. All right, Lengor. Appreciate the lurk, my friend. Raven says it was beautiful and 76 today. It's been really nice here lately. I know Monday, I was telling my guys to do it. I get off work, dude. I'm going to sit on that back patio. I'm Dawn Starlight says I was talking to my Yankee friends last week, and I had to remind him that one to three inches is a lot for us southern folk. You ain't kidding. Jock says it has been beautiful in mid-70s this week. I told my guys that I'm going to twist my wife's arm, make her go sit on the back patio with me for a little bit today after work. I got home, I couldn't find hope. I was like, all right, she's probably in the bathroom or something like that. Nope, that girl's on the back patio with the dogs. Cold beer in hand. Cubby says that is what she said. One second, thank you that follow. Jock says this time of year is a great time to hang out by the smoker. The dangerous one, thank you for that follow, bud. D Wynn says, What's happening, bud? What up, D? What you know, good man? Dawn Starlight says, I have an old smoky moonshine cocktail in the fridge. I should see to that. You should. Don't make, don't make it sit in there by itself. It gets lonely. D Wynn says, Just mowed the front and side yard. Let's go, dude. I may, I may look out and not have to do, do a yard this weekend. I may get lucky, because it's not, it's not rolling, I mean, it's not growing too terribly fast. Missy was like, I wish the yard did, I mean, the house did that, or laundry did that. Sorry. This back put me so behind on the yard. I bet it did, dude, I bet it did, man. Are you getting it kind of squared away now? Cookie says, Hula, if you want, you can come do my yard. Man, you know what, Cookie? I flat out would love to, man. Uh, but, um, mom, um, uh, yeah, hold, Cook, give me one second. I'll come up with a good excuse why I can't, dude. Just give me, give me one sec. 
Cubby says Hula, I told Chaos he needs to come to Texas and we will do a small gay sort of barbecue for him. Hey, D Win says just pushing through the pain, but it's not as bad, just a discomfort now. Well good, at least it's kind of settling down for you dude. I'm really seriously thinking guys, as long as this finial is, this may wind up being one of my bigger urchins. <gasps> nope, too late, I already made the inside. Sugar! I didn't measure the inside of this dude right here. Oh, sugar, which way did I measure? I did the white one. We, we did the white one. Okay, we did the, we did do the, yes, we did. Sorry. Sugar! I'm thinking. Y'all caught me literally thinking here. I'm like, oh, which one was this? So what I'm gonna do now is we're gonna find the outside diameter about where we wanna cover this up at. Eh, right about there. I got a buddy of mine, we call him Tomcat, it's kind of his road name. Oh, uh, so, uh, good lord, Vietnam vet. Good dude. But you start talking, the dude talks more shit than anybody I've ever met in my entire life. More than Cubby. Jock says that sounds dangerous, Hula.